Hi everyone, my name is Mark Smith. I'm a product manager here at Lucian, also a certified dental technician. So what I'll show you here today is uh, me scanning on a new generation red e-scanners. This is the E4 with the equivalent PC, so that configuration together. And the feature that I'm going to show you is the die in impression feature that we've introduced a while ago actually. So impressions in a lab, you typically pour them and then you may section models and then you start scanning that. So what we've introduced is you have the possibility of making a single die and you prep that die or that margin really really well and then you combine it with the impression scanning meaning that you save a lot of time on that to scan it together and that feature is possible on all of our e-scanners out there so what i'll do right now is start scanning that up so you get an idea of what that workflow looks like okay so i've already set up the order and set it up as an impression and ready to go and i'll follow the indications or the workflow bar up on the top bar so I insert my prep side of the antagonist and I have the scanner ready to auto start. So whenever I place my hand and load it with the model and remove my hand, it will start auto start. So it scanned the upper as a pre-scan. I mark my area of interest, which will give it more details in that area. And that will do a, a swift scan on that side. And then afterwards, I'll flip it around, take the other side, and at the very end, I'll scan the details around the die and then combine that into one model. And then at the very end, I'm ready to design. So I've scanned one side, flip it, go to the next step, and then scan the other side. What I can do is I can go back and forth in the different steps, the ones that I've already done, and start trimming. So I can use my idle time to trim while it's scanning. But I need to be fast on this scanner. So now my antagonist side is scanned, and I'm actually ready to load my single die which I've made. I go to die step and I rescan that. Then I use my idle time to start trimming my antagonist side. It doesn't take a long time, just some clickings. And then I have a green check mark. My die is done. I'll trim that. I'll get a green check mark and now I'm ready to design. So thank you for watching.